today we are playing Life is Strange and I have all I've only did episode one I'm doing episode two three four and five today so I hope you guys enjoy this and before we start into it I'm gonna fix my camera Alright, now it's aimed at me. And I have my drink here so that I can drink my drink while I'm playing. And I also have my phone to make sure that I'm recording. How are you guys this morning? Good? I'm good. Yes, I am recording. Yay! I'm recording so so let's begin and we are going to go to my saved game and we're gonna play episodes and We've played episode one last time, and today we are going to play episode two. So let's start. I love this game. In the previous episode of Life is Strange. Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Film, Whoa. little pieces. What of the food. fuck? But he could be talking about photography. Or have you done something wrong? Talk to me. Hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? I see every. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. For reals, Warren. This is between you and me. Don't make sense. I'd see you today. Welcome home, Max. That's Rachel Amber. Her missing person posters are all over Blackwell. Six months ago, she just left Arcadia, without a word, without me. Something happened to her. Wait, is that grass? Tell me the truth, that's an order. I didn't black out, I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. Max, tell me everything.
What the heck is she wearing? No amount of rewind will keep me clean. I still need a shower. Good morning, clothes. I hope you slept well. Now, shall it be my Gucci shirt with the Vuitton? Okay, Max. Let's hit the showers now. I actually don't know where the showers are. Do not forget I need those papers before tonight. Like now. Thanks, Sherry. Yeah, of course, Victoria. I'll get the tests and papers to you this afternoon. I am so on it. Ow! Alyssa, can you stand over there? Um, okay, Max, if that makes you happy. Wow, now that was close. Thank you, Max. I just saved her life again. Like this. Macking on those bros? Ew. We shouldn't be watching this. Everybody's seen it. <laughs> What's happening, Dana? Everything cool between you and Juliet? Oh, yeah. Thanks again for releasing me from her captivity. By the way, the best and biggest news of the day is that Trevor asked me to the Halloween shindig. That's awesome, Dana. At least we're showing our faces together in public. So you absolutely should go with us. Borrow one of my outfits and come as a cute geek couple with your bitch Warren. Uh, I'm not big on cosplay. Don't let life pass you by, Max. So, are you coming to the party or not? Why the fuck not? If I hate yeah. it, I can always go back to my room. That's the spirit, Max. After this, you'll be ready for a rave. It does sound like fun. Now I have to go contemplate my party future. Hello, Juliet. Hey, Max. Did you check out Kate's hot video yet? Why should I? Because it's fucking hilarious. Church girl gone wild. Kate's not like that and you know it. Really? Check her out and tell me what she's like. Do you believe everything you see? Like Zachary sexting Dana? Touche. Now I feel like an ass. Thanks for finding out the truth yesterday. Are you sure? I thought you'd be pissed. Not at you. Part of me was almost disappointed because I built up so much rage. Glad to see you're back in action. You have a good heart, Max. And I won't watch Kate's video anymore. Or pass it on. That's the spirit. Thanks, Juliet. Sure. Talk to you later. Why, hello again, Alyssa. Okay, Max. That's twice you've saved me from a projectile weapon. Are you my guardian angel? Hardly. I just have a sixth sense for trouble. I'm glad to help you out. Blackwell has a surplus of assholes. Oh, by the way, Warren said you borrowed his epic film flash drive. I didn't know you were a sci-fi geek like us. What's your favorite? I love Back to the Future, of course, but who doesn't? Can you imagine going back in time to Blackwell in the 1980s? We'd suffocate from all the hairspray. You and Warren do know your sci-fi. Be careful, you might make Brooke jealous. I'll just pretend I have no idea what you mean. Oh, well, hey, Kate. I didn't know she was going to be in hey, here. Kate. How are you doing? I'm here. Thanks again for standing up for me yesterday. I needed that. Anytime. That guy has issues. Doesn't everybody here? By the way, Max, do you still have my copy of the October Country? Oh, yes, of course. It's great so far. I didn't realize Bradbury was such a poet. 
Can you please bring it back to my room this morning? I just need to take some notes for class. Absolutely. I'll bring it by later. Close your eyes, kid. Just take a shower. What's up, Kate? School. That's it? That video of you clubbing didn't look like homework. Victoria, that wasn't me. Oh my god, right. Don't be shy. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> you're going to be sorry someday. Oh, boo-hoo. I'm sorry you're a viral slut. I'm sure she had fun. Looks like it. I know Nathan hooked her up. And you know he has the good shit. Preach it, sister. Yuck! I still have goddamn paint all over my face. Max Selfie thought she was a badass taking that picture. I should have beat her down. That was so uncool. She's jealous because Mark, Mr. Jefferson, knows I'm going to win the Everyday Heroes contest. He thinks Max is a joke. Girl, Amber. You do She's know a Max with is that dumb camera. in the. <laughs> I hate that I'm so quirky crap. Anyway, let's leave the link to Kate's video so everybody gets a chance to see her in action. You are such Don't an evil you dare. Bitch. I love it. <laughs> They're writing something on the window. What do they write on that mirror? Amber, you are a little jerk. She's a meanie. That was fast. All right, let's go look at this note. I'm gonna give back Kate's book. Hello, water. Sorry, I forgot. Even if I can stop one person from watching it, it's worth it. Wait, what, what, what did I need to look for? <gasps> oh, no fucking way. Somebody trashed my room. This is not why I came Nobody's to messy. Oh. to clean all this crap up? After I find Kate's book. <laughs> it was under here. Search. No book here. Really? There it is. All you just spilled soda on Kate's book. I better fix this fast. Kate needs the book, and I don't want to add to her list of problems. Well, what can we do? Rewind. Oh. Be gone, foul soft drink. That a girl. Aha, you sneaky book. You're mine. Now I just need to take it to Kate. I need to get dressed before I go there. Oh. Maybe don't I'll look. just put on a shirt. Oh, and okay. I was about to say, don't hey, look, Einstein people. Had the same exact suit for every day of the week. And he there she goes. Away. She did it. Now, where's Kate's room? Am I gonna know now where I can Kate's finally room take is? This back to Kate before I'm late. As if I have to worry about being late anymore. No brook here. <laughs> if 
fine, I won't disturb you. Kate? You in there? Yes, I'm here. Come in, Max. There you go. What's wrong, Kate? Um, hey, Kate. I brought your book. <laughs> Max, why did you step in between David and me yesterday? I hate bullies. David Madsen should know better. I was hoping he would. But it's nice to see that you care about me. Kate, I actually do care. So, what's the story with you and David? Well, he's a total paranoid ass. He thinks I'm part of the Vortex Club. All right. What about this video? And I swear I haven't watched it. I can't even watch it, Max. I won't either. Thank you, Max. You know how humiliating this is for me? I know this sucks, Kate, but tell me about the video and maybe I can help. Basically, I went to one Vortex Club party and ended up making out with a bunch of people. And I have no memory of it. That's awful. So, how did that happen? It's a long story. I'm still trying to sort it all out. You have to tell me more than that. What happened at the party? Did you drink? I swear to God, I had one sip of red wine. And then I drank water. Are you sure it was just one sip? I take a sip at church, and I don't end up on a viral video, okay? Did somebody drug you? I remember... I remember getting sick and dizzy. Go on. Then Nathan Prescott said he would take me to the hospital. Nathan Prescott? Oh, shit. He was being nice for a change when he offered to help me. He's the opposite of nice. What next? All I recall is driving for a long time. Then I woke up in a room. I thought it was a hospital because it was so white and bright. Go on. I'm listening. Somebody was talking to me in a soft voice. I thought it was a doctor until I heard Nathan and felt a sharp sting in my neck. And... And... And? That's all I remember. I don't know what happened. I woke up outside my dorm room the next day. I didn't have any marks or bruises, but I felt gross. So, who took the video of you at the party? I have no idea. Probably Victoria. She was there being her mean self. Jesus, Kate. I'm sorry. This is serious shit. How do I get mm. a viral video taken down? I know it's already spreading. What if my church sees that? I need She has a bunny! Kate. She has a pet bunny in her room. I didn't I'll even know that. Later, okay? That's adorable. Thanks, Max. You can put my book And it looks like back. Skittles. The pet bunny that she has looked adorable. Wait, what? Kate is all alone dealing with this video bullshit. Oh. Her mother doesn't disown her. That's sad. So, Max, can I ask you a question? And please be honest. Absolutely, Kate. Anything. I need to find out if Nathan Prescott helped me or hurt me after that party. Should I go to the police? If you do that, they won't believe you. You're on video grabbing at all those guys and they'll use that against you. Bad. But I know I was drugged. That's what you have to prove. 
Not them. I'm just telling you how the cops in school will look at this. The video doesn't exactly back you up. You make me feel so hopeless. No, no, Kate. I just don't want you to get hurt anymore. That seems impossible at this point. So that's your answer? I, I think we should wait. There are other things going on that might help you. But not right now. So I can walk down the halls with people calling me a viral slut. Thanks, Max. Good job, Dr. Max. She didn't like... Kate used to play the violin every morning. No. She stopped last week. That's saying. I'm gonna look at her button. Don't mind if I do. Oh. I took a picture of the bunny. Oh, that's adorable. That is the cutest bunny ever. I bet Kate is a good mommy. I bet Kate is a good mommy. <laughs> I had no idea that Kate ever hung out with Alyssa and Stella. Hmm. <laughs> Why did she cover up the mirror? She can't look at herself? All right, where are we going to? Oh. This one was a private number. Know you're smart. Much. Shut about everything. Or I'm go coming to. I'm coming for your. Oh God, that is a private number. I have a feeling that's Nathan. I have a feeling that's Nathan. Nathan. How come you don't ever talk to your Do you mom? All this crazy shit going on. It is so cool having Chloe back. Hey, Brooke. Oh, hi, Max. <laughs> you look distracted. Everything cool? I was riveted by that weird snow flurry yesterday. I can't tell if you're being serious or not. Um, since I'm a science noob, I was wondering if you could explain it. I'm serious. Science Even noob. Meteorologists <laughs> can't explain that snow. I bet Warren can. Did you talk to him yet? No, not at all. He's my friend, not my mother. True. And Warren really loves to talk meteorology with me, since I'm one of the few who can talk back. Talk to you later, Max. Okay, bye, girl. Go away! People are sleeping! Clearly not a morning person. Taylor is no doubt being led around by Victoria, as usual. That is so damn cute how much Dana is into this Halloween party. Trevor is making himself comfortable. Ugh, hope they don't get busted. I can't even imagine what life would be like being a cheerleader. Dramatic, I guess.
Fine, I won't disturb you. No brook here. Hey, Samuel. You're up early. Oh, hello, young Max. I do love the early morning. Everything is so calm and quiet. And I can feel the animals waking up with me. I so don't want to get in the way of your morning ritual. See you later. Of course you will. Come on over here. Warren, what are you uh, doing? Warren! Hi, Warren. Nothing. Waiting for a call? I mean, I already took the call. Anyway, I wanted to rap about that action yesterday. By the way, thank you for stepping in. You were pretty badass, Warren. I owe you. Oh, yes, you do. I got knocked on my ass by that dick. I'm some personal superhero. You're a real everyday hero. You stood up to a bully and it was awesome. Even though you left me with said bully and ran off with that girl, she's pretty punk rock. How do you know her? An old friend, Chloe Price. We haven't seen each other in a while. I bet you were glad to see her blast up in that truck like a rock star. Which begs the question, why is Nathan Prescott getting psycho on you? I busted him in the bathroom yesterday with a gun. I'll give you the story later. Principal Wells is taking care of it now, I hope. You're fucking weak. Like that bizarro snowfall yesterday? Speaking of dystopia, that drive-in is having a 70s Planet of the Apes marathon. Let's go ape! Yes, that's exactly what I need. I love those old-school ape films. Well, that was easier than I thought. Cool, I'll text you the info. Wait, where am I going? Oh, I'm back at school. David talking to Nathan cannot be a good thing. This has uh, something to do with Kate. Uh oh. Or Rachel. Yeah, it has something to do with Kate or Rachel. She's going to a bus. For what? I don't know why she's going to a bus for, but whatever.
What is happening? I gotta be quiet. Oh, they're not talking. Trees just on a bus. I see the lighthouse. Now where are we? Don't try to take it from me. It's mine. I wouldn't dream of it. Be a millionaire. Hope nobody steals my lottery. Talk about going back in time. The diner looks exactly the same. No time for chit chat. I'm a millionaire. Yep. Got my lottery ticket right here. Waiting for the bus so I can cash it in. Hi. You look lost. Close. Do you know if the bus has come yet? The online schedule isn't working. I don't know. It runs pretty regularly. I cannot miss this job interview. But I've got to take the bus out of Arcadia Bay to Newport just to find work. Are things that bad here? Where are things good? I can't even afford to live here. Well, good luck. Thanks, I sure need it. <laughs> All right, am I allowed to cross? Oh, I got a message from Chloe. Breakfast and the sound of clanging silverware oh, makes me feel 13 again. You'd never know how weird this town is by these postcards. That graffiti has been here forever. to you such a beautiful day eh? oh yeah it's gonna be a super day enjoy your breakfast eh? did you catch any big ones today if by big you mean none then sure I caught a lot of big ones today now let me mourn over my eggs Wow what's up Justin getting my coffee on before I cut class and destroy some rails shouldn't you be taking photos Not yet. I need to get my coffee on, too. And throw in a little green bud and you have the perfect hippie cocktail. You are so not a hippie. So where's all your homework, schoolgirl? School? Speaking of buds, I saw your bro Trevor sneaking out of Dana's room. Trevor finally told me about him and Dana hooking up. He got there first, so I snooze and I lose. See you later, Max. Bye, Justin. Hey, Trevor. Holla, Max. By the way, I know you saw me in the dorm. Yeah, I saw you coming out of Dana's room. Yeah, and I finally had to tell Justin because, well, he was into her too. How did Justin react? I got him blazed. He was cool. Nobody has secrets in Blackwell anyway. See you in class, Max. Drool. Want everything. Uh, 
Hello? Pardon moi, but you're in my eyesight. Isn't everything in here with an eyesight? I don't care for your tone. You sound like Joyce. How does Joyce sound? Bossy and smartass. Like you. Why are you being so rude? Because I've been on the road for 12 hours straight, hopped up on coffee and diet pills, carrying two tons of nitrate, and all I want to do is eat a quiet breakfast and stare out the window. Never do this, do kids. Never mind. talk to random strangers. <laughs> I don't feel like talking right now. I gotta deliver a load of breakfast to my stomach. Hey, look. Here's a policeman. Hello, sir. Hi, young lady. You look a little lost. Just hungry and thinking about what to eat. Now that is a real problem at the uh, two wells. I can never decide. Joyce's pumpkin pie or grilled mac and cheese. I guess you're friends with David Madsen. I wouldn't use that word. We know each other. Why do you ask? Just curious. I'm surprised he's not a police officer in Arcadia Bay. I have respect for David. He served his country. He found his calling at Blackwell. At the station, we're happy David is exactly where he is. <laughs> not everybody can be a cop. How well do you know Joyce? I know her delicious grub. Everybody at the station comes here. We take care of this place like it's our own kitchen. And Joyce, like she's our... our mother. So, you know Chloe? Sadly, we all know Chloe down at the station. <sighs> Poor Joyce. Just heard that Chloe even had a pot dealer in her room. Uh, who told you that? I didn't hear it on the police scanner. Joyce said the weed belonged to Chloe's friend, but I highly doubt that. Joyce didn't tell you who? <laughs> she wouldn't. Afraid I'd go arrest somebody, as if I would. I'd just tell that loser to stay the hell away from Chloe, or else. I'm <laughs> just kidding. Besides, David Madsen's watching her. Is she a friend of yours? I know her. Then you know she's a handful. She can be, but she can also be a good friend who shows up when you need her. Sounds like you're a good friend. I wish she would be a great daughter and not cause Joy so much stress. I have to go now. Enjoy your breakfast. By the way, one thing I can tell you for certain is to stay away from the RV outside. I usually stay away from sketchy parked vehicles. Wise policy. The guy who lives in it, Frank? He's pretty sketchy himself. That's all I can say for now. I should finish up my coffee and get to work. What do you want? I feel like shit. Too much beer, so spare me, please. Just let me suffer quietly. Nope, I don't want to go there. <laughs> nope, I don't want to go there. I don't want to go that way. Good lord. Talk about apocalyptic.
And there she is. A lovely young woman. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. It's nice to see you again. You look the same. <laughs> like I'm still a waitress at Two Whales after all these years. No, like you still look pretty. Nice save, kid. You're still smart. But not that smart. Now you get busted for smoking pot. <laughs> I heard the whole sordid story from David. I'm sorry this was how you had to meet him. He's a good man, no matter what Chloe says. Yeah, I'm sure. I don't even smoke, like, ever. It was almost an accident. It was very stupid. I'm sorry. <laughs> it surprised me fierce. I was hoping you could be a good influence in her life now. I will be. Promise. I know things were it's hard It's Chloe's fault. She's the one who had the I dang... Bad I didn't call. She's the one who now had the dang smokers. I'm all alone at She's the one who smokes, not home. me. You did the right thing. You Not Max, I mean. Your life. I did after William passed on. Chloe? Chloe chose to stay angry. Anyway, I hope we see more of you. Chloe needs an old friend again. Joyce, I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. I'm glad, Max. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Even if Chloe doesn't understand yet. Oh, he must have changed a lot during that time. Oh, she hit all the phases. Expulsion, running away, drugs, bad boys, tattoos, piercings, blue hair. <laughs> now she's got to rebel against her stepfather. I see why, I mean. Do you? He's not as much of a hard ass as you think. But you did tell him you had a joint, right? You took that responsibility? David scared me when he said he might have my scholarship taken away for that stupid joint. Nobody's in trouble over a doobie, Max. And I admire that you took the heat for Chloe. Like a great friend. But Chloe does push David, and it's not fair. He paid his dues in a war. He does care about her, along with all the students at Blackwell. He cares about Kate Marsh? David mentioned her, but I'll stay out of his business. I won't patrol Blackwell, and he won't cook at the diner, you know? I saw him arguing with Kate. I thought you might know why. Nice try, Nancy Drew. But next to you, there's only one student I'm worried about. And she's not even in school anymore. So, now let's get down to the nitty-gritty. What do you want to eat? I was dreaming about your bacon omelette. Now finish your coffee. One bacon omelette for the young lady, staff. Bacon at 12 o'clock high. This is like fourth dimensional deja vu. I keep going back in time. Can I get some beer and bacon? This is like fourth dimensional deja vu. I keep going back in time. <laughs> Looks like you had plenty. Stick with the bacon. Order ready. This is like fourth dimensional deja vu. I keep going back in time. No beer. What, what kind of dive is this? The only thing that's changed on the menu are the prices. Ham. No. What's that say? Home style eggs and bacon. Apple sausage oatmeal. Bigfoot pancake oatmeal. Bigfoot bacon oatmeal. Gross. 
Gold photo oatmeal. That looks terrible. Morning glory waffly. Waffle. <laughs> what is a budgeon waffle and french fries? Oh, fried fish. Sorry. Try our fast and famous breakfast menu. Bigfoot bacon, apple sausage, crab cakes, hash browns, bagel with cream cheese, and two slices of toast. Now I'm just looking at this menu. It looks good. I can hear your stomach rumbling from here, Max. Here, you love this. That was funny. <laughs> I'm drooling like a baby. Still can't believe you're a woman. When I look at pictures of Chloe, oh. speak of the devil. Chloe! Mom and Max, together again. And Chloe looking for a free meal. You put your whole damn college fund on your tab. I'm treating Chloe for breakfast. Are you atoning for yesterday? Oh god, Mom, please do not give Max any shit for that. She apologized. I know she did. Max is a good girl. A woman. She's 18 now. Too old to get lectures from you or Sergeant Pepper. Call him David if you don't want to be lectured. You only get one damn slice of bacon a day. You guys are still the same. Another reason to blow this town. What is this shit on the jukebox? Uh. Now that that's out of the way. Let's talk about your superpower. I don't have any explanation. And I can't explain why I saw that crazy fucking train. Come on, that's just a daydream. I want proof you can rewind time. This is all happening so fast. We'll start slow. Right here, now. Mm, I can tell you every single thing you have in your pockets. You have x-ray vision, dude? I don't even know what's in my pockets. Let me see. Okay, Max. Impress me. You have a tube of glitter in there, right? Nada. Eh, wrong answer. Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. That was Jeez. beyond epic. Fit. I was just Maybe about to choose to that. I can't go backwards. Darn it. Oh, I can. Well, this is me telling you what's inside your pockets. Okay, Max. I'm hella ready. Keys. Your car keys. Duh! Way too easy! I need details! Describe my keychain. Oh, don't make me choose. You definitely have a razor blade keychain. That was so wrong, Max. Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. Man. That was beyond epic fail. You even made me want to believe you. So, this is me telling you what's inside your pockets. Okay, Max. I'm hella ready. Keys. Duh! Way too easy! I need details! Describe my keychain. 
Potato skull or bullet? A bullet. Just like your necklace. That was so wrong, Max. Gosh, darn okay, it. psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. That was beyond oh. a big fail. You even made me want to believe you. So this is me telling you what's inside your pockets. <sighs> You guys okay, are gonna do it correct. Of... It's a skull. Keys? Your car keys. Duh, way too easy. I need details. Describe my keychain. A uh, skull keychain for a punk like you. That was so wrong, Max. Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. That was beyond epic fail. You even made me want to believe you. I have no idea. Is the answer just I don't know? So, this is me telling you what's inside your pockets. Okay, Max. So, we I'll already know it. it's keys, and we're gonna choose don't know. Your car keys. Duh, way too easy. I need details. Describe my keychain. I don't know. Do you have some kind of power or not? Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. That was beyond epic fail. You even made me want to believe you. Okay, Max. Study every item carefully and don't forget anything. Looks like a panda. And cigarettes, money, and a. This is a warning ticket. Okie dokie. <sighs> Why am I going all the way back? Don't know. So, this is me telling you what's inside your pockets. Okay, Max. I'm hella ready. Parking ticket. A parking ticket. You know me well. But what is the exact time I was busted? Ooh. 6.42 a.m. I don't even think about getting up that early. Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I know what to do. Don't tell me. That was beyond epic fail. Okay, guys, I gotta redo this over. Okay, let's look at it back. Okay, Max. Study every item carefully and don't forget anything. The keys are panda. Or whatever that is. She's got cigarettes. She's got quarters and, and one nickel and pennies and then she's got a parking ticket that was 10 34 in the a.m. and that's about it so now we need to go back I am so confused so this is me telling you what's inside your pockets <laughs> okay Max I'm hella ready Money. Some money. Clearly I'm rich as fuck. How much do I have? Oh, I don't know this. I lost count. She's got three quarters. Makes 75 cents. Plus the one five makes... Plus five makes eighty. And oh, 
86 cents. That's right, living large in Arcadia Bay. So that was cool. Show me more. You have parking A ticket. Parking ticket. Really well. But what is the exact time I was busted? 10.34 a.m. Booyah, Max can tell time. Even a broken clock is right twice a day. Whatever the hell that means. I'm pretty sure you have cigarettes on you. Yes, you know I'm a smoker. But how many cigarettes? Oh. That is hard, but I saw how many cigarettes and I think it was six or seven. Oh, that allows you to count cigarettes. Cool. Amazing. Something else in my pockets? Your car key. And my keychain. Panda? Pixel heart keychain. Pixel heart keychain. Oh, what? Do you even know me? Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pockets. No! That was beyond epic fail. You even made me want to believe you. God dang it. I got the keychain wrong. Okay, Max. Study every item carefully and don't forget anything. That don't look like... What is that? Is that supposed to be a penguin or... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven cigarettes. I was correct about that. Twenty-five, fifty, twenty-five, twenty-five, fifty, seventy-five, eighty, eighty-six. So I got that correct, and then I got this one correct. You got this, Max. Now okay, Max, oh, you've got it. We got this under the back. So, this is me telling you what's inside your pockets. Okay, Max, I'm hella ready. The parking ticket. A parking ticket. You know me well. <laughs> but, what is the exact time I was busted? 10.30... 4 a.m. Booyah! Max can tell time! Even a broken clock is right twice a day. Whatever the hell that means. Hmm. Some money. Clearly I'm rich as fuck. How much do I have? 86 cents. That's right. Living large in Arcadia Bay. So that was cool. Show me more. I'm pretty sure you have cigarettes on you. Yes, you know I'm a smoker. But how many cigarettes? Seven cigarettes. A superpower that allows you to count cigarettes. Cool. Amazing. Something else in my pockets? Your keys. Car keys. Duh, way too easy. I need details. But I don't know the keychain. Key <clears throat> we did pixel heart. It's not penguin. Panda. A cute robot panda keychain. <laughs> not bad, Supermax. Get it. Yes, I got it all correct. Thank God. Ooh. Panda robot. Amazeballs. I literally just got chills all over my neck. <laughs> you have powers. I'll take that crap off the table, Chloe. Sure, Mom. How's the food, Max? Better than I remember. Very good save. Man, I'm hungry like a wolf. Clearly. <laughs> I'm freaking out about what just happened. You, you have to show me more. Something way cooler so I won't <clears throat> leave you without any doubt. I will predict the future. No way. Oh, don't dare. Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments, so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. Oops. Did you break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh, 
And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. Better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So, what are you waiting for? Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. Happen in the next 30 seconds or so. The cop drops his glass, and Joyce argues with him. So, what happens next? Oh, shit. The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio, and he answers it. Well, let's just see how this goes down. Justin and Trevor are fighting, and Joyce breaks it up. This is getting good. Can't wait to see what happens. The jukebox goes crazy as a cockroach crawls on it. Pretty bizarro, Max. But let's see if everything happens like you said. Oops. That is Did so wrong. Did you break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. Now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? I think dick. not, Max. Bitch, take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. That is wild. That's Fucking a. This is sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So, what are you waiting for? Oh! What just happened? I, didn't I do that correctly? Wasn't that Davy Jones's locker? Did you break another cup? Really? I'm going to predict four events that will happen in the next 30 seconds or so. The cop drops his glass and Joyce argues with him. So what happens next? The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio, and he quickly exits the diner. Well, let's just see how this goes down. Justin and Trevor are fighting, and Joyce breaks it up. This is getting good. Can't wait to see what happens.
The jukebox. I don't know, but I saw a cockroach. Pretty bizarro, Max. But let's see if everything happens as you said. No longer a cop. Oops. That is Did so Did you wrong. break another cop? Really? No refill for you. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a I think dick. not, Max. Me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. That is wild. This is a sad day in Maxville. I don't know what to do. God dang it! Uh, I don't know. So what are you waiting for? Nothing. I'm done. I quit. Now pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments, so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. I don't know any mad power, you big behoma. Alright, I'm not speaking to her. I'm gonna watch. <clears throat> I'm gonna watch this and make. I'm gonna watch this and make sure it's carefully. Okay. So, Joyce. Oops. Did walks. you break another cop? Really? No refill for you. So, that now is a cop. Take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. That is a cockroach. That's the best song I've this is yet. sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So, what are you waiting for? I'm going to predict four events that will happen in the next 30 seconds or so. Cop. The cop drops his glass and Joyce argues with him. So, what happens next? Or wait, no. Oh, go back. Go back. Please, go back. The cop gets an emergency. I don't want to do this crap! I hate. Leaves without I hate this. Well, Why are you making going. me do this? Justin and Trevor fight, and Joyce doesn't give a shit. The no, -uh. we're going all the way back, cause that's not what happened. Four <clears throat> events that will happen in the next. I hate this crap. I hate this crap game. Oh, it's the trucker. The trucker drops his mug and Joyce Thought it was a cop. <clears throat> so, what happens next? Okay, dr trucker drop his mug. Alert. The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio and he quickly exits the diner. Well, let's just see how this goes down. Justin and Trevor are fighting and Joyce breaks it up. This is getting good. Can't wait to see what happens. And then last but not least, a Cockroach. The jukebox goes crazy as a cockroach crawls on it. <clears throat> Pretty bizarro, Max. But let's see if everything happens like you said. <laughs> Oops. Dude, Did you right. break another cup? Really? Mug. No refill for you. Shh. Now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? I think dick. not, Max. Me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. That is wild. That's Fucking A. This is sure the hell better than that other garbage. 
I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So, what are you waiting for? Ah! Now, I don't pay get attention it. to everything that happens in the next few moments, so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. This is just some hard game. Why am I playing it? I don't know. It's hard. I don't know what to do. I'm going to speak. I don't know what to do. God, Lord, how mercy! I hate this game. I don't want to play no more, you guys. I quit. <laughs> The trucker, the trucker drops, drops his, his mug. mug and Joyce rips him a new one. So what happens next? No, Joyce does not. Can I go back? And he answers and he eats a donut and his partner leaves. Huh. The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio, and his partner in the car leaves without him. Well, let's just see how this goes down. Justin and Trevor fight, and Joyce doesn't give a shit. This is getting good. Can't wait to see what happens. The jukebox goes crazy as a cockroach crawls on it. Pretty bizarro, Max. But let's see if everything happens like you said. <laughs> There goes the trucker. Did you break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. Ah, that didn't go. That didn't go as. Hey, where is my partner? Partner left. So cool. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. You are really whiffing this. I was correct. Okay. Oh, this is sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So, what are you waiting for? Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments, so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. What the hell? I don't want to do it no more! God, Lord, how much I hate you, game. I hate your butt. I don't want to do it. Don't want to. Nope. I'm not playing. Nope, 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 nope. This game is just some bull crap. I hate this game. Y'all, I don't want to do it no more. I don't want to do it. I'm sorry if I'm yelling, but I don't want to do it. It's the trucker that the trucker drops, drops his glass. His mug and no, it's not a so mug, it's a glass. The cop gets in and oh my god! Well, let's just see how this goes down. Nah. -uh. This is getting good. Pretty bizarre. No, we're going back. I so totally messed this up. I'm going to predict. <laughs> Four events <coughs> that will happen in the next 30 seconds or so. <coughs> this game stinks. It's the, um, who is it? Joyce drops her plate, and the truckers make fun of her. So, what happens next? I don't know! I'm just confused! I have to look it up on my stupid Google. <laughs> the
The cop gets an emergency <laughs> alert on his radio. His partner in the car. I don't know how to do this well, stupid let's just see how this idiot goes game. I hate this game. I like, like, I love it, but the choices that I make are just, it's just so hard. Like, like, whenever the video comes on, you're gonna have to really focus on it, and I, I'm so lost now. <laughs> Justin and Trevor fight, and Joyce encourages them. This is getting good. Can't wait to see what happens. Don't know what that. I have no idea. The jukebox goes crazy as a cockroach. I'm not watching. Me. Pretty bizarro, Max. I know I got well, them all wrong. No, like I'm taking my headphones off. I know I got them all wrong, but I don't care. This game is just some. That is Did so you wrong. break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a oh, dick. You're so cool. Me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. You are Somebody really dropped their this. mug. Or their glass, I mean. This is sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So, what are you waiting for? I'm done. I quit. I don't want to play this the next few moments. crap Excuse game. Me, Jerk. Mad power. I hate you. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> How do you do this? I don't know. I don't give a crap. No. I'm going Speak. to predict. I don't give crap. Happen in the next you guys, I don't give a crap. I don't care about this game. Who was it? It can't be Joyce. And it can't be Trevor. It can't be Cobb. It is the trucker. I was correct the about that drops one. His mug and Joyce rips him a new one. So what happens next? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. The cop gets an emergency alert. I don't get it. <laughs> well, let's just see how this goes down. Guys, I don't get it. I'm confused. Justin and Trevor are fighting, and Joyce breaks it up. This is getting good. I don't what get happens. what I'm supposed to do. Plus, I gotta eat my. I gotta eat breakfast. I'm hungry. The jukebox goes crazy as a cockroach crawls on it. Pretty bizarro, Max. But let's see if everything happens like you said. I don't know if everything did happen like I said. Well, there's Joyce walking, and someone dropped their mug on the floor. Dude, did you right. break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. Now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a I think not, Slap Max. Me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. That is wild. Fucking A. This is sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So, what are you waiting for? Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments, so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. I don't know, I'm confused. Okay. Now, I'm gonna have to look at everything that happened. Alright. Let's do this. 
I'm not gonna speak to um I'm not gonna speak to the girl right quick. I'm gonna just watch. Oops. Did you break another cup? Really? He no dropped his mug. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. He has hey, to answer the call. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. That's the best song I've ever This is yet. sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Daisy Jones's locker. So, what are you waiting for? I had to make sure what I was looking I'm at. To okay. Four events that will happen in the next 30 seconds or so. So we know the trucker drops, the trucker drops his, his mug. mug. And Joyce rips him a new one. So what happens no, next? No, she don't bring him a new one. She said, I ain't, I ain't giving you no refill. Um... The cop has... The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio and he answers it. Well, let's just see how this goes down. Justin and Trevor fight and Joyce beats them. This is getting good. Can't wait to see what happens. And then the jukebox huh. goes crazy as a cockroach crawls on it. Pretty bizarro, Max. Well, uh -uh. Let's see if everything No, I ain't this. watching. I ain't paying attention. You guys, I got every single one of these wrong. Oops. Dude, did you right. break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. No refill. Take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a I think dick. not, Max. Me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. You are really whiffing this. Fucking A. This is yet. sure the hell better than that other garbage. I don't want to play. I'm done, you bull crap ass. So I'm done with for? this. I don't want to do it no more. Quit. Oh no, my god. No. I'm going to go do some research on this stupid game. How do I do it? I don't get it.
I don't get it. I don't get what I'm supposed to do, so I'm done. I quit. I don't get I quit. I quit with this stupid game. I'm trying to look at my phone to see if I can, uh... I'm trying to look at my phone to see if I can figure this out, because I don't know what to do. Episode, you dummy. Episodes. Guys, I don't get this stupid game. I quit. I don't care what happens. I just want to be done. I don't have powers. I'm going to predict. I don't have powers. Sorry, I'm upset. I don't know what to do. It can't be Trevor drops his glass. It can't be the cop. It can't be Joyce. And it can't be Trucker. So I don't know who it Trevor is. Trevor drops his glass and Justin makes fun of him. So what happens next? I don't know. I don't know. Guys, I don't get this stupid guy behind it. And his partner in the car leaves game the sucks. Well, let's just see how this, this goes. This game out. is Bull crap. I'm done with it and I'm not gonna play it anymore. Justin and Trevor fight and Joyce beats them. This is getting good. Can't wait to see game what happens. Sucks. I hate this game. I ain't playing it no more. I ain't playing it ever again. <laughs> this game sucks. Like, I don't know what to do, I, like, every decision I made console. so far, Pretty I bizarre, completely well, destroyed and happens, messed like it up. So I don't know what to do. I've gotta be quiet, cause my family and my dad and my brother are sleeping. Oops. That is Did so you wrong. break another cup? Really? That no, is so can't. wrong. I don't get him a stupid idiot. I hate this game. I'm done. I quit. I don't know how to play. So cool. Ah, la 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 la. No, I ain't playing this game no more. Really living this. You in a hell of a? What the hell? Why can I not do it? I don't care. I'm done playing this. Stinking crap hey. game. I don't this get it. Sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So what are you waiting for? Now, pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments, so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. <laughs> I don't get it. I'm upset. I don't get it. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? I'm so confused. I don't get what am I supposed to do? <sighs>
I don't get it, you guys. I'm so confused. What happened? I'm going to predict four. I don't get that will happen. I don't get thirty seconds or so. I don't get it. I don't The trucker drops his mug and Joyce rips him a new one. So what happens next? The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio and his partner in the car leaves without him. Well, let's just see how this goes down. I don't get what I'm supposed to be doing. Justin and Trevor fight and Joyce beats them. This is getting good. Can't wait to see what happens. The jukebox goes crazy as the I don't fly lands get it. Up. Pretty bizarro, Max. But let's see if everything happens like you said. Dude, Did you, you right? break another cup? Really? No refill for you. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You're a oh, dick. Oh, so cool. You, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. You are really whiffing this. This is a sad day in Maxville. This is sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Davy Jones's locker. So, what are you waiting for? I don't get what the hell. Well, I'm going to do everything that happens in the next few moments so you can dazzle Chloe with your Sorry, I'm getting power. frustrated now because I don't know what to do. Like, literally, like, seriously, I love this game, but it's just hard for me to do. Come on, fly over faster, you stupid. I'm trying to watch the video on here. Wait, I'm gonna hit this.